Hello friends, in this video, I'm gonna tell you a real-life story related to the Baki series. This is something that happened to the real-life Oliva Biscuit. I don't think it's necessary to remind you guys that Biscuit is based on the great Sergio Oliva, a famous bodybuilder of Cuban origin. However, for those who don't know, I'll give you a brief rundown of who this man was in life. Sergio was a Cuban bodybuilder, recognized for his impressive physique and a standout career in this sport. He is one of the few bodybuilders who has won the title of Mr. Olympia more than once. He was known as the myth in the world of bodybuilding due to his almost unattainable physique. He had an extremely narrow waist combined with very wide shoulders and back muscles, which gave him a perfect inverted triangle shape. This made him a standard in modern bodybuilding. Ithagaki decided to pay tribute to this man by introducing him in the Baki series under the name Oliva Biscuit. Even if the name was different, it's safe to say that fans would have instantly noticed that Biscuit was a parody of Sergio thanks to Ithagaki's tendency to frequently introduce real-life characters into the series. Ithagaki usually changes the names of the characters so as not to have legal issues with the names of these popular characters. After immigrating from Cuba to the United States, Oliva worked at a steel foundry while training and competing in bodybuilding. Later in his life, he worked as a police officer. He left an indelible mark on the world of bodybuilding and is remembered as one of the all-time great competitors. And well, having said all this, there was an incident where Sergio's wife shot him with a gun. According to reports, the incident occurred during a domestic dispute. Oliva was hit by several bullets, but miraculously survived the attack. This incident has often been highlighted in Oliva's biographies and profiles because it is fame in the world of bodybuilding. Sergio was rushed to the hospital, where they performed emergency surgery on him. He managed to recover after some time in the hospital. As the doctors told it, his huge muscular mass helped to slow down the bullets so they wouldn't severely damage any of his vital organs. An average human being would probably not have been so lucky. This incident was quite controversial and has been the subject of many discussions in the bodybuilding world. However, this did not stop him from continuing his career and his impact on the sport. Despite this incident, Oliva is remembered primarily for his contribution to bodybuilding and his extraordinary physique. I find it quite shocking that thanks to his muscles, this man managed to survive such a situation. Then, in the Baki series, we can see that Oliva Biscuit also accomplishes similar feats by resisting bullet impacts thanks to his huge muscles. The truth is that Ithagaki took some liberties when creating this character. Most characters in the Baki series underwent drastic changes compared to their real-life versions. This doesn't bother me, I'm just mentioning it as a curiosity. Maybe in the future, I'll make a second part of this video comparing events from the Baki series to real life. So, leave your suggestions in the comment box. And well friends, thanks for watching the video, don't forget to subscribe if you liked it. I hope you have a nice day or night. See you soon.